Hello everybody, Father John LeCarrie here. Um, this weekend we celebrate the solemnity of the most holy body and blood of Christ, Corpus Christi, um, the annual um, focusing on Jesus' real presence among us. The second coming of Christ has already happened. Um, Jesus is present in the Eucharist, he's in the tabernacles all over the Catholic churches of the world. He's also present where two or more are gathered in his name. So many ways the Lord is present. What we really await at the day of judgment is the third coming of Christ. But let us take advantage of Christ among us now and Christ with us in the Eucharist particularly. Um, also, what we are celebrating this weekend is the um, ordination of two men to the priesthood, the now new Father Richard uh, Graham and Father Raymond Herod. Congratulations, men, to you and your families, and God bless you. Um, there are many people the Lord has for you and for me to meet along the way as we um, preach the gospel, dispense the sacraments, and um, encourage people to keep on keeping on with hope, faith, and love. I'd like to bring to your attention also um, to uh, save a life and contact Congress. And what, I'm, what am I talking about here? As you know, Congress is trying to force Americans to pay for abortion. How? The Hyde Amendment and similar laws have protected taxpayers from funding elective abortion for 45 years. Now powerful members of Congress want to take away these laws that both Democrats and Republicans have supported for nearly half a century. So what happens without these protections? Billions of taxpayer dollars could be used to pay for abortion. How do we take action and let our voice be heard? Sign a petition to Congress at NoTaxpayerAbortion.com. That's at Congress at NoTaxpayerAbortion.com. This is one way that we can help defend the body of Christ. Life is sacred. It is meant to be here when it arrives here. Maybe the money that's used to fund abortion, if the Hyde Amendment is being taken away, that money really should be used to fund um, maternity homes for, mother, for women who, who say um, adoption instead of abortion. That money could be used for life, not for death. So again, stand up, have a voice, be heard, and celebrate Corpus Christi. God bless you.